I'm working on a project. I love it. Love for you to join me. Right. Uh, welcome back, guys. This is uh making Megas four. I think this is this might be either four or five. I don't know. Um, so. Currently, I am working on this quick shot. The last time we spoke, last make it make it, I was doing a um, a shot for Mana, the one of the characters in the series. It was just a reaction shot, so it didn't take as long. Like I think I mentioned in the video. Um, also mentioned in that video which was ended up being true that I will probably be past like maybe two more shots after that I've done three I think no three counting that one so done three shots um, there's a couple of little small previews and stuff on my Instagram uh, link in the description um, or tag in the description I don't know whatever <laughs> I'll put it in the description of the video so let's see where are we at right now we are oh so yeah okay so this is also a short one kind of like that one but a little more things in the picture so it's just it's gonna take a little longer than that one but um, I tried to do a video before I was gonna, I was gonna test out maybe doing um, like a voiceover type of video instead so that way I can maybe get more <laughs> animation done instead of focusing on drawing and talking at the same time but um, turns out I didn't like how it was afterwards it also required more editing that I didn't really want to do so um, and I had finished it too. I condensed the time down and everything. And I didn't like it. Um, so, back to this way. Re recording. Uh, and we'll just try to speed through the in betweens a little bit faster. I might have to turn off this background layer though because I cannot see. I'll just darken it. Okay, so. So, um, as far as the series goes, little updates on a couple things it's moving along pretty well the spot I'm at currently in the script um, it's probably let's say two shots away before we get another character introduction and some conflict and all that stuff so should be good uh, Is it helping or not? Oh, that layer is distracted me. Sort of. Anyway, um, it should be getting more action, and I'm trying to decide now because once I get to the action stuff, uh, there's a different sort of method. To animate in it and I'm kind of trying to figure it out you know it's gonna be more detailed as far as like camera movements and all that stuff when the action and stuff starts happening so I'm just trying to prepare myself for it um, which seems a little difficult I don't know because everything I do now is I have to, have to like, I'm not, I wouldn't say plan for it, but it's, 
definitely more difficult to uh, switch up. Let's get rid of that over here. Distract it. Now, if this was a different part, like some real action, instead of them just walking, I probably wouldn't even, uh, wouldn't do it like this. I'd probably go frame by frame just to get it a better fluid movement. But in order to protect myself on some time here, I ended up doing it this way. Um, switch that back on the screen. It just looks like a bunch of mess right now because of the onion skinning. But Oops. Let's see what it looks like. There's only one, but let's see what it looks like. Speed. Okay, I gotta fix this other arm. Bing. I don't know why his arm is a uh, kind of skinny. I mean, he is a skinny character, but actually, you know what? It's not even bad. I'm gonna leave it the way it is. Uh, you may be wondering why they don't have faces right now. <laughs> Random, but yeah, it's uh, it's kind of how I have to. I mean, I don't have to do it that way, but I tend to do my animations that way because. Um, being able to focus on the facial um, features and sometimes people talking, it makes it easier to animate it, like going frame to frame and just focusing only on the face so I can get like the proper eyebrow raise at the right time or whatever, or just little stuff like that. Be connected. Just see if I can. Oh, I gotta drop that. Oops. So I will have to go over everybody's actually probably since they don't like overlap or anything it's gonna be a little more work but um actually doing their faces on separate layers is a uh, is more work in itself and that's one of the things i'm trying to figure out a better way of doing like i know i should just do them all on one layer save myself the time But, I don't know, whenever I'm doing, like, the whole face and body all in one go, it just feels like it's taking forever. So. I'm going to make his arm swing just a little bit. So. Something like that. Let's see. Not even noticeable. All right, whatever. <laughs> um. <clears throat> At this point, uh, I don't know if I want to explain that. Maybe the uh, it'd be better to just let the show explain it. Yeah, I could probably simplify it. But at this point in time, the the boys, they know each other. 
like not like super close or anything but this is technically supposed to be the next day and I don't know like I, while I'm doing this animation I don't know if I got that across well enough but this is supposed to be like the next day at the end of the next day's class at this point so oh I didn't even remember to do that in editing the uh, transition but yeah um I keep forgetting to adjust it but basically um right there this is the next day they've gotten to know each other a little bit small little time skip jump hop whatever you want to call it um and now they're kind of like it's at the point in time where you'll notice like okay yeah they're going to be hanging out for the show uh looking at here i think this arm uh oh. Let it play. Okay, that's good. All right, so on to the next. Um, for finer details, you just do another in between, in between the in betweens. Because <laughs> I don't make that make sense, but I mean, I think somebody might make it might make sense to somebody. Uh, but for this scene, I probably won't do minor, minor details like that. Uh. Once they start getting to the action and the fighting and stuff, then I'll probably do that. I don't know if I... I'm looking at these sideburns, and I don't like it that much now. Because, like, when you're this close doing it, you're not really paying attention, but... You start to notice it eventually. And I don't want to have to go through all of these frames just to fix it, so we just gonna do... It's not so bad definitely noticeable when you're picking out little things though um let's see um got some exciting things i think they're exciting i don't know how excited anybody else would be about them but got some plans for next year um there's this challenge um photographers do called the 365 challenge or at least i learned it from a photographer and basically wait there you go for anybody who doesn't know what they do is they make the effort to um do a picture take a picture every day for a year that's the challenge um, I'm gonna try to do something similar for my animations which is why it starts next year because I don't <laughs> I got other stuff I'm trying to do right now to finish before the year's up but um, I won't be doing the same doing it the same way because <laughs> that's way too difficult for somebody like myself and knowing myself that's a surefire way to make me um, not do it at all so uh, I will be adjusting the the, um, the challenge to fit better fit animation so yeah, I'm gonna try and do a uh, I guess a 52.
animations. So what that'll do, hopefully, if I can stick to it without, I, I feel like if I'm, I don't want to speak it into existence, but I feel like enough uh, distractions in a day, like one little minor thing, will throw off the whole process, and I'm hoping that don't happen, because, like I said, I know me, and <laughs> one thing is more, one thing will mess it up, and it'll be like, oh, well, I could do it tomorrow, and then that happens, I'm pretty sure <laughs> a lot of people can relate to that. I'll fix it tomorrow, you play catch-up most of the time. It's already going to be difficult, uh, so I know that. Um, and I know that because I'm still going to be working on this. And all of the animations, I intend to have them related to the series because I'm trying to make the whole channel based around the series. But um, all the animations, they'll go up on the channel and on my Instagram. So, you'll be able to see them in both places if you don't use one or the other. Although, I recommend... <laughs> I recommend subscribing to the YouTube channel. This leg is going the other way. So distracted right now. Let me turn this off for a second. Okay, so here. Oh, okay. That was really <laughs> Amy tripping. Um, those lines are from his sleeve. Um, so yeah. Distracted for a second. Um, move this. That. I don't know. I think everybody. Uh, not everybody. I'm pretty sure there's gonna be some people have their comments and comparisons. So. I don't think everyone will love it, but. I think for its simple, I don't know if anybody will like it for simple concept. <laughs> if anything, if nothing else, I'll try to make the action scenes good enough. <laughs> Can't guarantee anything as I have not done any action scenes yet. I do this. I don't like that. I'm just gonna leave it that way. It is. Haven't done any action scenes yet. Coming up on the first one pretty soon. Okay. I'm about to fix this one as well. Let me do it now before I forget. see that but whatever <laughs> I don't know. I'm a, I guess I'll just move it like this. Oh yeah, that should be. Let me just move all that. Just get rid of it.
there. So maybe I'm not focusing. <laughs> Just go straight silent. But uh Yeah, so the plan, the plan, the plan, the plan. Um there will be hopefully something for Um, I don't say all genres, but hopefully something for everybody in the series, from the franchise itself. I don't know if I told anybody, but I intend to make this. I know I've told a couple people, but not not, not a lot of people. I intend to make this my equivalent to um, Star Wars. Like that's the ultimate goal. Distracting because he's the only one. Those legs you can see. Okay, back to this. Gotta fix this. supposed to be together. This was deleted. There's not a whole lot to talk about on this one. It's just... It's pretty straightforward. I'm just doing in-betweens. Like, even on the last video, when I <laughs> tried to short, like, make it a shorter video, it was a... Uh, dang, it ain't even been a half hour yet. Even on that one, still couldn't, like, come up with much to say. Because in-betweens are boring to say the least they you don't <laughs> they're born to watch somebody do i'm sure but making make is, is a monthly thing this is i'm just keeping you caught up on what's going on um, and at this point in time this is what's going on Okay. Let's see what I can do for that. But yeah, this is this is basically why you don't see you only see like the finished product <laughs> from people's animations. This is probably why. Then turn that one like that, and then.
So I did try to do a time lapse version. So I mentioned that. I think what I'll do. For future um, and probably this one as well. I'll probably just speed it up and not talk too much about what's going on because it's already obvious what's going on. I'm doing in betweens. So that's it. I'm not coloring. Uh, so I'll do a time lapse for this one so it won't be so bad. But I don't know. It's still an hour's time. Maybe I'll do less time. Or, you know, I'll work for an hour and then still speed it up. What else is new? Hmm. I already told you the news. Uh, I don't know why I hate that so much. Uh, <laughs> I'm actually kind of eager to get to the um, the, the challenge because there's there's a couple video ideas I have. I don't really want to ruin them right now, but um, since it's going to be centered around the series, I think it'll help to give like uh, background, character background context that I know about and that I have written down for the Megas Wiki. It's not actually on Wikipedia, but is I wrote down all of the details. There's a whole Wikipedia about the series, all the little backstory details and stuff. But they're not like as detailed as I thought of them. So, like I wrote it down, but only so I don't forget, you know. So like I know details about their parents that aren't in the wiki as much as uh, they I suppose could be I've done as much writing as I want to do because <laughs> I need to see the action and stuff so I don't want to keep making the story and not having anything done because I don't have another animator to do it so I got I mean I want to see it so uh, the series he got a really short torso on it. Well, I mean, I guess he is kind of further back than everybody else, but. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna spend all that time working on him. Take Noven, too. But, yeah, so. The, um. The wiki explains kind of vaguely uh, things about the characters and not vague I mean some of it is a little detailed but only the important stuff like 
plot-wise important stuff was uh, detailed. Other stuff, um, like certain people's families and all that, that, that stuff, it's not detailed, but I do know how their stories go. There's also other scenes that won't, I mean, they may make an appearance. They won't make an appearance in this, in this, uh, series. I mean, in this season. But they could make an appearance, um, later down the line. You know, like, maybe flashback or something, but... Because of that, I think some of that stuff will be the content that I do for the challenge. So that way, you know, I can bring y'all into my brain, get let some of this information out, because uh, the series has a uh, <laughs> consumed all my time as it should because I want to see it done but it's a pain in the butt to have all the information and not be able to share it so I'll do little video clips kind of giving context to some of the Maybe even relationships and stuff that you'll see. Oh. All right, Let me take it all the way back. going from there to there so the hand is going to be there yeah I think that actually works or maybe more like that there we go okay And fix this. So that's one of the ideas I have. The other one, mm, that one should be okay, kind of fun, maybe. I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> I don't really want to explain that one though. There's a reason why, but <laughs> it should be all right. Let's see. I think clear it out a little bit. Let's see, okay, forty minutes in, and we only moved two frames so this is kind of just directing upon plans upon plans. No, over to Alec. Um, 
don't know if I've ever mentioned what their names are. I don't think I have. Only a few people know their names. People who've seen, like, the making of type of stuff. Um, uh, I don't know if there's a point to mention them here. They mention them in the very first episode. When that comes out, you'll see. Uh, I have to make new pictures. I guess there's not much to do, but I'll move it a little bit. Uh, you really, the size. Really changed. Try to shrink it down, but it looks. Bring that up to about there. I think that kind of work. I'm just gonna is off. I think I might have definitely cut it in too tight. fix it, sort of. Uh, this one just needs to be bigger to match. I mean, it's initially small because the uh, arm is swinging backwards, but to match the other ones. Also really low. That's one. Well, that one's low too. So <clears throat> that's the other problem. Okay. Well, we'll fix two A in three. Two A doesn't need much changing, but still needs some.
his part that you can't even see. But anyway, uh, let's see. Let's see. Two more? Three more. Probably three. Let's see. I think we probably do three more. Not in this video, but yeah, so where are we at now? What was going on? Um I do a better look at the uh uniforms and the hairstyles <laughs> uh did i mention it in this one no i think it was the first time i tried to do this video so yeah um one of the things i'm worried about not necessarily worried i don't know i'm gonna test it and find out for sure how i want to do it but it's a big issue for me to do, to figure out which one I want to do first when I'm animating backgrounds or foregrounds. For this one, I did the background first because it's just a, not a static shot, but it'll be edited to be a little more lively later. Um, but when it comes to the action shots, from the experience that I do have, um, it feels easier to do the characters before the background because that way you can get that little camera movement to make it look more dynamic but I don't quite know for sure if uh, if that works best Even this right here, I'm gonna have to redraw him. I gotta redraw him. And I think probably just his head and arm might have to be redrawn. Well, yeah. Hmm, his arm might not need all that, but. Yeah, but once it comes to the action and stuff, I think I'll do characters first. Feels like that'll be a better move, so I gotta move this out mark right here. This is actually kind of the reason I wanted to maybe do these as streams instead, but I don't have the uh, <laughs> equipment for streaming right now. I think about it if I do these as streams they probably I mean they wouldn't necessarily pick up a whole bunch of followers or anything but 
think they work better in streams. So we might get to that point. I don't know. I don't want to put so much effort into doing these that it takes away from working on the project itself. be done after this one. Okay, clean up these edges. Alright. So we got this arm connects to there for the next shot. Onion skin, one of the most helpful tools in all of animation. So let's see, now we gotta reconnect this. Ugh, alright, let's um, bring that down. He doesn't move, huh? Wait, what? What the heck is going on here? four minutes um I need to turn his head or at least start the motion of it maybe maybe I can't pull that off you know, bigger eraser just redraw it Probably uh, shrink that back down because it's a little stuff. Right. So let's see. So this chin will probably be here. Okay, 
so. So I'm going to go like this. Time. So it's still a little choppy. Um, so probably we'll do some uh, more in betweens. Like one in between here, maybe even one in between here. And then, of course, gotta do there in betweens which actually I'll just delete uh, get rid of them now because I got to redraw them completely the whole body because they're in a different position and it'll just be easier to draw them from scratch than it would be Yeah, that's cool. All right. 
Pick up a beat now. It's going to be a little rough. I might go into the sketch layer and do a quick sketch of them before I redraw them just to make sure that they kind of stay lined up. Because when I turn the onion, oh, you know what? Onion skin might be okay. Yeah, I think I could do it with just onion skin. But alright, um, I think that's gonna do it. Be sure to like the video, comment if you want. I mean, that's cool if you don't, but share if that's if you want to help. <laughs> And most importantly, subscribe. Probably the biggest help you can do right now. Um, I also have a Patreon account. Trying to put unique things on there so that it's worth going. Um, but they're mostly animations and they take longer. And <laughs> they, like, I think the next. Um, the next animation that I do for like the uh, what they were called the intros I don't know if it's gonna be the actual intro to the show but like the fire in the wind uh, animations um, the next one was supposed to be water and then earth was after that I think those will go if I ever get around to doing them those will go exclusively to the patreon um, might take a little clip from it and make a reel or something but uh maybe i don't know or short youtube short but um maybe i'll put a reel on instagram to the and keep the channel going i don't know but anyway um trying to put more exclusive stuff on the patreon so things you'll see on there are like uh kind of like the make and make it stuff but like for detailed uh, parts like this I forgot I put one on there recently but it's real time I, it's not it's something I have to go and check it but it's um it's something from one of the projects I just finished not projects one of the shots I just finished I don't think it's this one I think it's the it might be the shot I did before this one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It was the uh, time-lapsed version of the shot I did before that one. And um, that's up on there. Is it time-lapsed? It might be time-lapsed. I don't remember. But, yeah, that's on the Patreon. Stuff similar to that. So kind of like make and make its episodes without me talking and time-lapsed so condensed I don't know it's probably better to switch them around uh, but I don't know we'll see leave a comment if you think that's what I should do switch them switch them around because I think I could probably get more content up faster even though making megas is supposed to be a monthly thing if I switch the way I do them I can post up more stuff um, and maybe I, th I think I put music on it because I wasn't talking, but I don't know. We'll see. I don't know. But yeah, like, comment, subscribe, 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 subscribe. <laughs> That's more important. Uh, did a pretty good job so far, guys. Appreciate the people who have subscribed. The channel went from, I think, 17 to 30 subscribers in a short period. And I think I know how, so I'm going to definitely try to do that again, get some more of you guys to get on board. Because I think, especially next year when the new projects and stuff start, um, I think it'll be a lot more to be engaged with, like much more worth being subscribed for. Right now, just to make it make his episodes, I don't even blame you if you don't watch them they're technically for me so I can see what I've done and you know go back and look and see like learning from my own 
mistakes. <laughs> but it's also for people who like want to see how it's being made. And may anybody who may have suggestions on like ways to speed it up, different options. Uh, I'm just doing what works best for me at the moment, you know, like trying to figure it out. But I'm gonna I'm gonna end it there because this is going over an hour. So I'll catch you guys in the next one.